it's Day Sims, and welcome back to my channel for part 6 of Let's Play The Sims Life Stories Season 1. So we're picking up exactly where the last part left off, and Riley had gone to call Dylan, and it says, Sorry, can't talk, I have to go to, uh, work. And then he hangs up on us. How sketchy is that? Like, come on. Um, okay, that was strange. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to go to the corner boutique on my own. Too, too bad about the dresses, though. So, either way, we're gonna go shopping. So, let's go ahead and call a taxi so that we can head over and take our mind off of the horrible news that we got last night um, in regards to Mickey and Agora getting married. How crazy is that? Like, that totally escalated out of nowhere. What, they've been broken up maybe a whole day? Maybe even two days? And he's already jumped on another bandwagon is going to marry some crazy woman. So, yeah, that's going to be fun. So, poor Riley. She just really needs to figure out what she wants to do with her life because girl has it bad and... It just, it sucks that she's hurting so much, you know? So we're going to go ahead and head over to the Corner Boutique. It's actually funny because it says, why buy later when you can buy right now? Come to the Corner Boutique for all the latest fashions. Yeah, that's definitely something I would say. I am a more of a buy now, ask questions later, or like buy now, cry about my bank account later. So yeah, that's, it's a struggle, guys. It's a serious struggle. And, I mean, it would be nice to buy some new outfits for Riley. I mean, she's been wearing the same tank top and jeans, or halter top, I guess, and jeans since we started this series. So, I mean, I know this isn't a very long series. It actually, I think it's going to be ending quite soon. And um, let me know if you guys want me to do season two of it. I forgot the name of the sim that we play as, but it's in this game, in the Life Stories game. But there's a season two with a male whose name I cannot remember. But if you guys are interested in me playing that season as well, I can definitely do that. I am, I love this series. I think it's so much fun and there's so much drama in this. Like, oh my goodness. It's kind of crazy how much drama there is. So we are here at the Corner Boutique. And let's see. We should, ooh, there's a lot of people here. That's exciting. So many clothes, so little money. <laughs> the struggle. I need to budget my cash wisely. So I think I'll just try on two outfits. Look at you trying to be all productive and whatnot. Oh, that's, why is it? Okay, whatever. Um, she's going to go ahead and try on, let's try on an everyday outfit. You are not going to go on the swings, girl. We can try on an outfit and then we should try on, uh, let's try on a formal outfit maybe. Whoops. I don't know why the walls are up like that. It's kind of annoying. Okay, that's a little bit better. Ooh, okay, so let's see what type of full body. Ooh, that looks nice. Ooh, so many things to choose from. Okay, so this is an everyday outfit, I'm pretty sure. So what should we try on? Hmm, ooh, go back. Let's try this on. This looks like it might be quite nice. Let's go ahead and try that. Where are the fitting? Oh, the fitting rooms are back there. Wait, is that a camera on top of the fitting? Oh my god, the camera is looking into the fitting room. Ah, Sims 2 memories. Such great, great memories. So I'm going to go ahead and speed this up. And oop, I actually do want to see what she looks like in that outfit. Did she come out yet? Oh, I thought she came out. I guess not. I really want to see the outfit because that actually it looks like something I might be interested in buying maybe. Oh, okay. That sucks. She didn't show us the outfit, but that's all right. I'm sure we'll um, figure something out. So let's go ahead and try on another outfit. I think this one's formal wear, I think. So we can pick out maybe a new dress or something. Just something nice for her to wear. Whenever she decides to. It's already 7 o'clock, which is crazy. It's getting so late already. Let's go ahead and speed this up. Perfect. Ooh, I like this one. That was such a lovely color. I bet that would look amazing on her. And back to the camera staring at us through the stall. Oh, oh she did try it on. I totally missed it. 
This looks great on her. Look at Riley. She looks so good. I love that. I'm not sure which one we should buy, but who knows? Maybe we can venture out with her style a little bit and see if there's anything she... Ooh, who are you? Oh, whoa, okay. Well, look who's here. Dylan, and he's all over Ashley like a cheap suit. <gasps> oh my goodness! Oh, he's going to regret ever have that he ever crawl, came crawling back into my life. I'm going straight over there to show him that no one messes with Riley Harlow. You tell him, boo. So, oh my god, I cannot believe him. Like, he literally talked all that crap about how, like, we were his one and only and all of that. We should definitely, like, go attack him because we're going to go crazy on him. And Ashley Sinclair? Who even are you, Ashley? Like... Really, he's probably only into you because you're blonde and we were blonde first. So, sucks for you, honey. But we're going to come over here and give you a piece of our mind, definitely. Really, dude, you were so freaking fake. Why are you talking to her, Riley? No. Don't be nice to the enemy. What's wrong with you, girl? We need to... <laughs> She just jumped on him. She literally didn't ask any questions. She just walked up to him, jumped on him, and now they're fighting. So that's a lot of fun. Oh my god, this girl is so crazy. I love her so much. I hope she wins. It'd be kind of awkward if she lost. It'd be really, really awkward if she lost. Yes, she won. Thank you. That would have been so bad. You, you, ooh, someone has a potty mouth. Mm-hmm. You have no idea how good you had it with me. You're going to get it, Riley. You and that whining aunt of yours. Um, excuse me? Good riddance. I didn't need scum like him around me anyway. Too bad, I, too bad I didn't see him for the dog he was until too late. He cost me what was most valuable in my life, and he'll never be able to repay me for that. What does he, why does he keep mentioning aunt, my aunt? Where is your aunt? Like, where is Sharon? Sharon just dipped. Like, she doesn't care. Hello, what is this? Dylan dropped his wallet during the fight. Let's see. 2,000 simoleons? Oh my gosh. Well, I guess this is one way to start repaying me. I know what will make me feel better. Spending it all right now. Oh my gosh. Are you serious right now, Riley? Oh my gosh. We literally have to spend 2,000 simoleons. You know what? We're going to buy everyday outfit. We're going to buy a formal outfit. Maybe some PJs. Um, we don't really wear the other stuff, so we're definitely going to spend this $2,000, though, because, come on, he, that's the least he can do. So, there was a full outfit that I really, really liked. Um, oh, I think I passed it already. Oh, so I want to do this one. Go ahead and put that into the cart. That's 200 And let's see, maybe we can get a new shirt or something. There's a lot of different options, which is really, really nice. Let's see. Um, there's nothing that really speaks to me. Sims 2 clothing, I don't know. I mean, it's it's nice, I guess. We can get this shirt, maybe. And maybe a pair of jeans. Ooh, these are nice. Eh. I don't know. Eh, I don't really like those. Ooh, these are cute. We'll get those, and we can do the dark wash jeans. Perfect. Ooh, we can get some shorts, too. Ooh, let's get some shorts. Whoops. And so that's a 1,000, so we'll spend a 1,000 on that. And then, so we're going to go ahead and get formal wear. I really, really want this dress. So gorgeous on her. So, so gorgeous. And ooh, there's a cutout one. Ooh, Riley, you would look fantastic in that. Let's go ahead and get that. And then last but not least, we're going to get some sleepwear, and that will be 2,000 simoleons completely blown on clothing, which, I mean, hey, I would like to blow $2,000 on clothing, but I can't do that. So, yeah, that's not happening. Okay, um, let's see. We could do... Ooh, this gray looks good. And maybe this nightgown and the purple. Um, that looks good. 
That should be 2,000 if it might not be. I think it's 2,000. I bet this Dale's associate's just like, oh my gosh, this lady. Well, I did say that I wanted Dylan to buy me some clothes. Very, very true. Indirectly, he did buy you a bunch of clothing. So, fair enough. <gasps> Is this Mickey? Oh god, an Agora. Oh no, please not here. My day is bad enough without me having to see the love of my life with Agora, the mule-faced woman. <gasps> Riley. I love her so freaking much. <laughs> like, I can't. It was foolish of me to get involved again with that sleaze bucket Dylan while I had Mickey. This is too much for me to handle, so it's time to go home. Aww. Chapter 8. That two-timing scoundrel, I almost believed him this time, too. Well, no more. At least I got a few teeth out of him. Oh, my gosh. This makes the sting from losing Mickey even more painful, though. What I'd give to have Mickey back. Aw, honey. <gasps> oh, my God. This is so upsetting. Oh, my goodness. Like, Oh my gosh, we just, we need to go home. Let's, we need to go home. We need to leave, like, right now. Because this is just, it's too much. And I feel so bad for our poor girl. We just, oh my god, this is so awkward. The drama in this game is so unreal. We definitely need to go home. And the taxi will swing by in just a few moments to pick us up. I also thought about changing her hair up, maybe. Oh my gosh. I know, honey. I know. What does he want? He's going to poke us? Are you kidding me? I actually kind of want to see this because that is such an awful thing. Oh my gosh. That is so disrespectful. Like, what is wrong with you? Go away. Like... Why are you being so rude? Oh, Riley. Oh my gosh. So mean. Whatever. We're leaving. We're not going to take your crap. Go ahead and go home. I feel so bad for her. Everything was going so great. And she was happy and she had what she wanted. And of course, she got a little greedy and wanted a little more than she could handle. And now she's, she's pretty much lost everything. And... I feel so bad for her. And it's back to 5 o'clock, but we definitely need to grab some food and stuff. Go ahead and use the bathroom, take a shower, and we can grab some dinner. Man, I was hoping a trip to the, to the boutique, oh my gosh, I can't speak, would cheer me up. So why do I feel worse? Well, I mean, they were kind of making out right in front of you, honey bun, which... You know, wasn't very polite of them. I mean, to be honest, though, she did, they didn't know she was there until the end, right before she left. So while they were, like, kissing and loving on each other and serenading each other, they didn't know she was there. So it's not really their fault. But, I don't know, I feel like everything seems very rushed, if that makes any sense. Like, it doesn't make sense to where... Why would Mickey all of a sudden run to Agora when it seems like they've been friends for a while? Why wouldn't he, you know, go after her previously, you know? That doesn't make any sense to me. I don't know. Oh, actually, I do want to um, change up our everyday outfit. And I want to change our appearance when she's done because we do have two thousand dollars worth of new clothes thanks to dylan there so let's see what we have in here i love this outfit i know that that awful woman was wearing it but i think it's such a cute outfit i love it so much and um i think i actually want her to wear that i know it's the same thing the lady was wearing but it's just so cute and i actually do want to dye her hair because i don't want her to be blonde anymore not that I have a problem with it, I just, I feel like she's been blonde for so long, and, ooh, this is gorgeous. That's beautiful. What if we do, what color was her hair originally? Was it black or brown? How do you look with red? Eh, the red doesn't look all that good on her. Ooh, what if we do something crazy? Eh, they don't really have any crazy hairs. Yeah, I'm not really digging that too much. So why don't we go ahead and go back? Which how, which one was it? This one? Yeah. 
why don't we go ahead and kind of let her go back to her natural hair color, which I believe was brown. I could be wrong, though. But I think I think it's good for her to go back to the person that she was instead of trying to be someone that she's not. So I'm going to go ahead and have her sleep, and I'll pick up once something happens. Alrighty, guys. So Riley has just gotten home from work, and she randomly decided to read the newspaper. And it says, I can't let things end this way. That jerk Dylan showed me that a sincerely nice man comes by far too rarely. I will do everything in my power to, to try to restore what Mickey and I had together. No matter how long it takes, I will make it up to him. So... Um, <laughs> it looks like we actually need him to come over, which is interesting. So let's go ahead and answer our phone. And, oh, speak of the devil. How did, okay, interesting. He just randomly decided that he would call us. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and speed this up. I feel so bad for her because she clearly still has these feelings for him. And he's pretty much acting like she means nothing to him, which, I don't know, I mean, I don't really see how it's possible to just completely cut someone off, even if they were awful to you, I just don't see how you can just act like they don't exist, you know? So, we should probably go ahead and invite him over and speak to him face to face, it's probably a lot better to do that, honestly, because it's just easier, so... We're going to go ahead and invite him over and chat with him a little bit. Oh my gosh, our shower's broken. We will have to fix that. It's always a pleasure to see you. I'll be right over. Okay. You definitely weren't saying that before, but all right, whatever. Ooh, I love how we don't get bills in this game. It's lovely. <laughs> well, I mean, in the Life Stories game. In The Sims 2, you do get bills, just so you guys know, in case you've never played before. But I guess we're just going to wait until... Oh, he's here. Let's go ahead and greet him. And it looks like we need to get to friend status, I think. Oh, that was a cute little greeting. So let's go ahead and admire him and entertain him with a joke. Let's gossip a little bit. Chat with him. Just definitely talk to him and try to get things to a better place than they are right now. So let's just go ahead and speed through some of these interactions here, just because it might take a little while for their relationship to get back to where it was. Oh, what happened? Did he not like that? Okay, awkward. Okay, this is... Yep, that didn't work. Obviously, they don't have the same interests, which is awkward. But they're playing a little game, which is nice. So I'm just going to speed it up a little more while they do this. And okay. Well, he liked it, but obviously she didn't. Let's go ahead and admire him again. Um, play tickle, I guess. That's kind of how they fell for each other, playing tickle. Oh my gosh, he is like cracking up. We are so freaking funny. Let's go ahead and tell him another joke and admire him again. Maybe do a back rub and see how he feels about that. So far, I mean, they're doing okay. It doesn't really seem like they have an awful friendship with each other. So they're doing okay. Not the greatest, but they're doing okay. Um, I wonder if he would let us flirt with him. I want to try it. He's probably going to completely reject us. And I really wouldn't blame him for rejecting us. But I'm curious to see what he might say. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. So the attraction is clearly still there. Let's go ahead and... Okay, stop, stop. Okay, okay, fair enough. Okay, sorry. It worked. I know, honey. I know. It's okay. I'm sorry. It was working. And then it just stopped working. All right, then. Go ahead and have them chat a little more. We do have to probably head to bed soon just because it's getting kind of late. We do need to eat something. Why don't we just have an instant meal? That way it doesn't take too, too long. And so far, I mean, the relationship's going pretty okay. And I probably won't, like, film all of working their relationship back up because I'm sure you guys know um, what it takes to get relationships back up. It's not that easy, and it can take a little while. 
So while she is asleep, I will go ahead and fast forward and I'll pick up once something happens. Alrighty guys, so that actually took a lot longer than I thought it did. <laughs> and I'm very happy that I did not record any of that because it literally took like two sim days. So finally I got this little thing. It says, Riley, this is so hard for me to do. I'm so happy that we were able to patch things up, but I made a promise to Agora. What kind of man would I be if I broke that promise? He has a point, but I mean, come on. And these two have been like flirting and making out and like literally all over each other. Riley, I'd like you to have this. It's been with me all my life, but I'd like it. I'd like him to be with you now. What? I'm so sorry, but I have to do what I have to do. Don't forget me, Riley. I'll never forget you. Oh my gosh. Oh, honey. How could I ever forget you, my love? Oh my god. That is so depressing. But on that note, I'm going to go ahead and end off this part here. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed. I know that we don't have too, too much left of this series, so there might only be one, one or two more parts. But if you guys enjoyed this part, please give it a huge thumbs up. Leave any comments or suggestions that you have down below. Also, if you're new, please don't forget to subscribe, and I'll speak to you all next time. Bye, everyone!